Hey everybody, this is Karen. As promised, the very first just excited tutorial. It's just going to be a quick one. I'm using my phone, but I couldn't wait to do this. I actually read an email. I know some of you can't believe that, but I read my ASG email from Linda and the theme is leaves next week. And I don't have anything with leaves and I had to close up my camp. So... I went and picked up some leaves. These leaves are on my scanning mat. They're just right underneath the scanning mat. Here's the cover. They're pretty flat. I put them in a book on the way home. Sorry, I'm on my phone, so it's a little shaky, but I was just so excited to do this. So I'm going to load up my mat now. Put it in. How am I going to do this with one hand? I'm going to hit the load mat button, and of course nothing's going to happen. <laughs> okay, you should hold the mat. There we go, mat's loaded now. My leaves are secure. Now I'm going to hit the scan button, and I want to scan to cut data. There we go. And I think we'll leave it in the black and white mode. That's fine for what we're doing here. Now we'll hit our start button. This is going to take a minute. <coughs> the map comes out. <coughs> Sorry about that. It's recognizing the data it's scanned. This takes a second. I will remake this video. I do have my video equipment, but it's just not down here. And I was just so excited I had to try this out right away. Look at that. The leaves came out very nicely. This new Scan and Cut 2 has such a beautiful job. I only want the outline because I'm going to do little appliques on a sweatshirt for my mom. So let's hit the outline. This is going to take a minute to process. Let's see if I can focus in. Wow, look at those nice details there. Okay, so I'm ready with this file. So let's save it. Process, and I'm just going to save it right to the machine. Okay, it's telling me it's number six. Obviously, I need to do more. And there we go. And we're done with this. So I hit the home button. It says delete the all patterns. We're going to say okay. And now we're going to go to pattern, save data, go to the machine, and here is our file right here I did a test run right before the video but here's our file and I can bring it up and now I can move them around wherever I want I can delete one if I want I can do whatever I want and make my shirt ready to go uh, I can Look at them in here. I can change the size of them if I want. It's hitting the bottom of the mat. That's why it started. If I wanted it to get bigger, I could just move it like that and keep going. I don't want it on top of there, though. So, so there's your quick tutorial. There's more to come. I'll actually do a better professional job later. But I just wanted to quickly show you that you can scan in other things than just your patterns. Okay, so let's see what we all come to the ASG Buffalo group next Saturday with our leaves. I hope you all give this a try. I'll catch up with you later. This is Karen.